What's up guys, it's your boys and Wolkie back with another Fortnite video and obviously Fortnite has no short of c crossovers. They continuously pump them out. I definitely enjoy them. A lot of people are in the discrepancy area about wanting them and not wanting them and wanting Fortnite characters to be genuine and creative. But some of these Fortnite characters that we've had over the years of crossovers from Marvel, Transformers, DC Universe, uh... I mean, the sky's the limit that has happened. I mean, we got alien xenomorphs. We got Predator. We got uh, T-1000s of ter Terminator. I mean, the list goes on and on. Now, I definitely took a look at myself of how many people out there wanted different other collaborations. And the crossover collaborations that people want is enormous but we're gonna be taking a look at a few of them right now so grab a chair grab some popcorn also make sure you guys are subscribed to the youtube channel by hitting the wiper icon down at the bottom right hit the bell icon next to it so i do post videos like this one you guys will get that little ring notification that i've posted a video and then you guys can watch comment like and share and again thank you so very much for the continued love and support that you guys show on this channel every single day i can't thank you guys enough keep doing what you guys are doing and we'll continue to keep growing together with that being said let's get into the video so now we when you think about a collaboration crossover, you pretty much have no endless or there is no endless bound anymore because they have pretty much touched, I think, almost into every different subject when it comes to horror, funny, comedy, um, adventure, action. I mean, this I mean, and I think we've gotten romantic kind of certain skins, but we're gonna be taking a look at some ones, obviously Marvel. DC, but other characters as well. I definitely have seen and wanted to see other characters. We've seen like the Winter Soldier. We've seen um, characters in the Marvel Universe and the DC Universe and comics that we have not gotten yet as well. Now, starting off the bat, <coughs> these actually were recommendate or recommendation in the Reddit posts. So a lot of these are not what I want, but there's a few of them that I would like to see as well. But the first off the bat is SpongeBob SquarePants. Now this one is kind of funny. Um, if I bring this over here, the SpongeBob SquarePants is definitely <laughs> an interesting subject to possibly put into the world of Fortnite, but I would not put it past them for putting Mr. SquarePants in the battle arena. Now the next one I would like to see after we just got uh, Jason Voorhees or not Jason Voorhees, Michael Myers is a Jason Voorhees. Now I definitely think this would be a perfect uh decision in uh getting like fort nightmares for next year um what do you guys think let me know down in the comments because this would definitely be a awesome collab to have as well the next one is going to be is power rangers the Power Ranger ones, I definitely would love to have each and every single Ranger would be a fantastic addition to the world of Fortnite. I All these skins right now, I would definitely throw my money at it. Let me know down in the comments if you guys would throw money at this one. All you gotta do is hashtag and put in the, the one that you see right here and then definitely the money sign because I definitely would do this as well. Um, the next one we have is going to be Five Nights at Freddy has been a talk of the town for many, many years of in Fortnite collaborations. Um, we definitely could see a few characters when there's definitely a, quite a bit of characters to put in this game, but Freddy would be definitely one of those to put in there. Springtrap, Foxy, um, Bonnie, Chica. I mean, the sky's the limit. And I guarantee with all those kids at home, <laughs> well, I'm 35, including myself, I would throw money at this in a heartbeat. So um, one that we've, so there's a topic that we wouldn't be able to possibly get when it comes to Nintendo skins. Nintendo definitely doesn't want to throw out their their characters anytime soon um, when it comes to like uh, Pokemon and Metroid and um, the uh, the, um, the Mario Brothers, Mario Luigi. I don't see ourselves getting these anytime soon because Nintendo definitely wants to keep these skins or these characters on lockdown, but definitely having Samus or Samus, Samus would be a perfect addition to the world of Fortnite. And I guarantee a lot of people would fork out their money in getting this one. Now a collaboration with, which would be awesome to have is Marvel or not Marvel, but Call of Duty Ghost. Riley uh, would be definitely awesome to have in the world of Fortnite. We've seen Master Chief. We've seen uh, God of War. We've seen Tomb Raider. We've seen Doom. Um, I mean, what more could you have asked for? It would be more like, a, I wouldn't say a, a slap nod towards Call of Duty, but Modern Warfare uh, 3 with their skins, they're definitely um, having some similarities when it comes to Fortnite skins. But having... Uh, 
this ghost skin in the world of Fortnite would definitely uh, add a, definitely a cherry on the top to um, the characters in Fortnite. Now, another one I would like to see is a War Machine slash Iron Patriot. Since we already have an Iron Man skin, Marvel... I mean, Donald Mustard, I mean, which he's not the CEO anymore, but he said there is no like end to the Marvel scene. We're going to be getting Marvel skins and DC skins continuously. Um, but having a Marvel War Machine and, all right, Fortnite Marvel, Fortnite War Machine and Iron Patriot skin would definitely be in my books. I would buy both of them if they had, if you could have two different variations, a War Machine and then you could switch it to a P Iron Patriot. I would buy that in a heartbeat. Uh, switching over to DC Universe, which we thought we were going to get beforehand. We don't have a lot of villains in the world of Fortnite, but having Bane would be a fantastic addition um, just because the way he looks, obviously from the last movie we've seen from The Dark Knight Rises, but Bane would be magnifique in the world of Fortnite. Uh, and a lot of people would like to see Sonic, but again, with Nintendo, it's going to be a little hard um, to get this character in the world of Fortnite. Um, Hellboy would be one that I think would be a great addition to the world of Fortnite because this man in the movies uses guns and weapons and all that stuff, and seeing him on the battlefield would definitely be a cool addition. Uh, <clears throat> with Godzilla coming out Around the corner, having a Godzilla-oriented skin or maybe a Kong skin would definitely be pretty dope to have running around as this big, huge monster, but in Fortnite version would be magnifique as well. So, um, one that I think we should have, since we already have um, Venom from Marvel, is a Marvel Agent Venom skin. This skin, one I don't know where my Agent Venom statue is. Oh, he's over there. My Agent Venom would be a, an awesome, fantastic addition to the world of Fortnite. And he even said on uh, Marvel, Punisher would be another one because he uses weapons. He's tactical. Come on, come on, Epic and Fortnite. Put this in the game. Another game that just came out not too long ago was uh, Mortal Kombat. I was definitely surprised. I thought we were going to get something when it came to that. When any new movie, new TV show, new uh, game comes out, normally we would get an addition skin like this. I mean, we've had skins in Fortnite. They're like, what were they thinking? But this would be Scorpion and Sub-Zero would make an awesome addition to the world of Fortnite. Pickaxes could be a frozen blade. Um, his emote could be the, get over here. I mean, Come on, epic. Let's bring these guys to the, the battlefield. Another one that I was kind of bummed out to see that we had a couple years back, we had a glider from the Matrix. We got a weapon wrap from the Matrix, but we didn't get any characters like Morbius and um, uh, Morpheus and Neo and Trinity. I was hoping for a Neo skin. Bring this to the game, Epic. I definitely guarantee with all the skins that we've talked about thus far, they would be spouting these out with... Uh, buying these skins over and over and over and over again. And then speaking of Disney, or I wouldn't say speaking of Disney, but speaking of iconic characters, Captain Jack Sparrow is another one that people want so bad from Pirates of the Caribbean. If he could have the emote of the running away like uh, Johnny Depp does in the movie, that emote would be fantastic. And you could hear the dun, 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 dun. I mean, it'd be fantastic. So, um, another skin that a lot of people have been wanting was Buzz Lightyear. I think they could have done this when we had the Lightyear movie come out where you could have more of a realistic Buzz Lightyear, but the toy version of Buzz Lightyear, maybe a Woody would be <laughs> fantastic as well. I think this would be, I would, I would throw my money so far. Every single skin I would buy and add to my, um, my Fortnite locker. I'm telling you, I would definitely be probably poor because of all these skins coming out. Back to DC, another skin that has been highly requested is Robin slash Nightwing, possibly a Red Hood as well. We've had our fair share of DC uh, uh, versions of Fortnite characters. I was kind of bummed out when we didn't get a Michael Keaton's Batman in Fortnite. But again, I can't complain too much because we have Batman. We have Batman from the comics. We have Batman from uh, Christian Bale's Batman. But again, Fortnite, there's missed opportunities here. And you guys could just add these to the game. When we go from DC to back to Marvel, 
Winter Soldier was actually in the Zero Point comic books. If you guys have seen them, which I have all, all of them that have ever come out. Vision is in there. There's uh, tons of other characters that we have not seen in Fortnite that are in the comic books of the Zero Point when Marvel collaborated with Fortnite continuously. I think having a Winter Soldier character would be fantastic addition to the world of Fortnite as well. Another kind of quirky one, but funny one, since we have Family Guy, we have Rick and Morty, would be The Simpson. Having Homer running across the field, possibly having a back bling that looks like a donut. He's using a weapon and just have his funny voice running through the fields of Fortnite would be fantastic as well. One that I've can see very much coming to the world of Fortnite because we have now cars that you can update is Fast and Furious. If we could have a Dom Toretto and a Brian O'Connor, <laughs> come on guys. If we could have a Dodge Charger and a Nissan Skyline as our skins in the, the car versions, bro, I would be throwing thousands of dollars at that screen to buy these because Fast and Furious, I've been watching and growing up with over the course of how many years, and I would buy these skins so, so very much. So, with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys could write down in the comments what you would like to see when it comes to Fortnite collaboration crossover skins. I didn't or I didn't include any uh, TV shows. Um, people have wanted to see Big Bang Theory, Doctor Who. I mean, the, the list goes on. Star Trek, the list goes on and on. But those ones, I'm going to leave for a different video if you guys would like me to make a another part two. Another one is musicians. People want to see Billy Irish. People want to see Michael Jackson and Thriller. I mean, the list goes on and Elvis. People also want to see Rocky. I mean, again, the list goes on and on. I mean, pretty much Fortnite is becoming the new Ready Player One and I don't see Fortnite slowing down or any stopping anytime soon. It's just going to keep on growing and growing and I'm definitely along for the ride. Hopefully you guys are too. That's why I want you guys to comment down below what collaboration skin you would like to see. Don't forget to hit the like button because it helps out more than you guys know and then don't forget to hit that subscribe button as usual and we'll see you guys in the next one. So keep it real, keep it safe and as always, keep nerding on and we will see you guys next time.